<sighs> um, happy, happy 2018, everybody. Welcome back to the, I can't even really call this a podcast. This should have been episode 18, but we, we had a problem. Uh, essentially last night, uh, what happened is I had a guest on the show and we, the, the funny thing is we spent a couple minutes, you know, getting everything set up cause he had some new equipment and software. And so like we were kind of talking through things, getting all set up and we went to start doing the podcast and all of a sudden just everything went berserk on my end and his end, just like everything was just going crazy and we spent like a good 40 minutes trying to get reconnected to record the show. So after 40 minutes of playing around with, you know, <laughs> the softwares and our equipment, resetting computers, all that kind of stuff, after 40 minutes, we finally record the podcast. And when I got the audio, it was just messed up. So we have to figure out what's going on with our softwares and everything. Like we just, we tried, but we didn't end up getting a podcast um, that could be published today. We didn't get it done last night, and I just would not have had the time to do it today because I had to work today, and it just wouldn't, I, I wouldn't have been able to do it. It's kind of a bummer because we, like, we had a really cool podcast. We were talking about swearing and what is the, the Christian stance on using, like, profanity and stuff like that. And I actually thought it was a really cool podcast. Like we talked about a lot of really cool stuff and it was like a 50 minute podcast and now it's just gone because our software just wasn't, it wasn't working properly and there's not much I can do about that. So I apologize. Uh, what should have been episode 18, it just disappeared. It, it's gone. <laughs> um, I, I can't fix it. I mean, I'm sure that like somewhere out there like there are softwares that probably could have salvaged it but I don't have softwares that advance but uh anyway so uh, the friend that was supposed to be doing the podcast um he's going to become a somewhat regular on the show um he uh, he's my friend Steven he's been on the show before and he and I don't <laughs> we don't agree on much and, and I mean, he knows it and I know it, so I'm not like, you know, trying to bash him here, but we disagree on quite a bit. But we, I think that when he and I talk like off camera, I think we have really good conversations and we want to bring some of those conversations publicly and kind of talk about different issues, but kind of look at the, the different sides of things. Um, cause I mean, Steve and I are kind of like, we're, we're night and day. Uh, theologically, politically, in every other sense of the word, we're, we're very different people. Um, and what's interesting is the last time he was on the show, I had people who were like, oh yeah, I, I really agree with what Stephen had to say. And then people were like, no, I, I really agree with what you had to say. And so like, I got mixed op opinions on that. But anyway, um, there are lots of things that we're going to be arguing about. <laughs> Not really arguing, but you know, just kind of debating in the future. Like he told me that he did not agree with a lot of the stuff I've said on previous podcasts and he would like to challenge some of that. And I'm like, you know, great, bring it on. Um, and I don't mean that in like an aggressive kind of way, like, er, fight me, but in a healthy, okay, let's look at scripture. Why do you disagree? Show me the scriptures where, you know, you're saying what you're saying is wrong. Um, I welcome that kind of stuff. I think that's good. I think it's healthy. So we're, we're going to do that. So I guess you could say that's, um, one of the, the new things that'll be happening, um, during 2018 is you're going to start to see more like, I guess you could say debate style, uh, podcast where you're seeing two sides of an argument being presented. Like the few times that, uh, my friend Carlton was on this show, like, he and I were very similar. Um, like I, I haven't found too much that Carlton and I disagree on, except that he eats pineapple on pizza. That's a big one. Um, but yeah, I mean, theologically, like we're both Calvinists, we're both complementarians. Like we agree 
on a lot but Stephen is like he's very different and that's okay like he's he's still a brother in Christ and we can we can debate stuff so if you have any topics you would like us to kind of hash out um contact me uh go to christiansemotion.org slash contact and just send me an email there um and I will you know try to get a podcast on it but again um I I did just want to jump on here and and apologize for not having a podcast this week I didn't just want to not say anything and uh, leave people hanging because you know I say every Wednesday there's an upload so I didn't want to just leave people like uh where's the podcast I wanted to say something but we just had some technical problems you know what are you gonna do we did everything in our power like we even recorded like a 50 minute podcast and like when I like I said when I listened to the recordings they were just like they're all messed up and it was it was weird so what can you do I mean sometimes it, it was rough like <laughs> we were getting pretty frustrated I was like ready to rebuke this computer. I'm like, get behind me, Satan. Um, But while I am here, I do have a few minutes to talk. I also wanted to let y'all know with uh, the new year, another thing I'm really going to try to do is some more interviews, uh, not just on the podcast, but on camera as well. Um, My grandma actually has a lot of stuff that she's very interested in in discussing uh, publicly. My grandma is a psych nurse. And she's been wanting to talk about the relationship between faith and things like depression um, and and kind of examine mental health through the lens of a biblical worldview. And I'm like, that's totally relevant um, right now because a lot of people suffer from anxiety and depression and various mental illnesses and stuff like that. So I think that would be a great thing um, to open up for discussion. And in addition to, you know, trying to get some people that I know that I think have some really good input, uh, trying to get them, you know, on the podcast or on camera or whatever, I also want to try and get a little bit more personal. Like, I want to start doing some vlogs and Q&As. Like, I recently did a poll because I found that, like, that's one of my most responsive posts. Like, when you ask people a point-blank question... And you say, okay, let, let's talk about this. People respond. Whereas when I just kind of like post pictures or memes or whatever, they don't generate that kind of response. So <clears throat> that's one of the things that I am going to be trying to do in moving forward with with 2018, with a brand new year, just trying to get more personal, uh, a bit more interactive, uh, talk to people more about you know issues that we see in our world today and all that kind of stuff. So for the last time, (laughs) I am very, very sorry um, that the podcast is not here. Uh, Stephen and I are going to try to uh, do that podcast again, Um, because like I said, I thought that we, like it was a good conversation um, talking about swearing, like swearing as in like cursing, using profanity. Um, I thought it was a really great conversation. So we kind of made note of some of like the scriptures we brought up and uh, some of the points we made. So we're going to try to redo that episode um, in the future. But again, I am really sorry. Um, I don't know. Things like this. That's the thing. You know, technology, it's it's unpredictable. That's I told Steven last night, I'm like, this is exactly why I don't like the idea of doing live shows. Because if something goes haywire, then like you're live. I mean, fortunately, last night, when we did have mess ups, we could just kind of stop and restart and stop and restart. But when you're live, it's like you're you're rolling. <laughs> and I just I don't I don't trust technology the way some people do. I'm like, you hit that go live button and it's like everything better work or because if it doesn't sucks to be you. But uh, I will have an episode, a, a full episode for y'all next week. I think I got things, I mean, I I did get things figured out on my end. I'm recording now. Um, Steven's kind of playing around with stuff on his end. Um, So I I will have a full show for you next week. Um, But thank you for your continued support again. I'm so sorry. I know I've apologized like six times already. Um, But yeah, I will have a show, a full podcast next week. Um, But thank you for your patience and 
again. I'm, I'm really sorry. <laughs> um, but hope you guys have a, a great week. And I hope that 2018 is the, the best, the best year ever. Uh, make this the year that you aim to, to glorify God and love others and point people to Christ, you know, get her done. <laughs> oh, get her done. Who said that? That was, I forget. Was that Jeff Foxworthy? No. Larry the Cable Guy. Was it Larry the Cable Guy that did the get her done? Because he did one of the voices in the movie Cars. And he said that too. I don't remember. But anyway, uh, take care you guys. God bless. And I will, I will, I promise, see you next week uh, with a full episode. Be sure to check out our website, christiansemotion.org. And consider supporting us on Patreon so maybe we can get working equipment. Uh, Patreon.com slash Christiansemotion. Take care. God bless. Goodbye.